This is Rev. Michelle Hopkins. This is the message of Anonymous to the United States of America. Expect us now. May 19th, 2013. Anonymous created a Facebook website entitled 519 2013 expect us this is anonymous's description of itself the gospel of mark 5 9 and he that is jesus asked him that is the man what is thy name and he answered saying my name is legion for we are many Legion was the name of the group of demons that resided within this human being. This man was so full of demons that those demons called themselves Legion. Anonymous is calling itself Legion. It is likening itself to a massive group of innumerable demons. Anonymous pretends to be on the side of the people. This is what it says. Your government has failed you. Republicans and Democrats alike sit atop Capitol Hill abusing their power and amassing wealth unfathomable by most. They do not have remorse for the citizen for you. They believe in the eternal servitude of all Americans and all peoples besides themselves. Your calls for help fall to deaf ears. Democracy itself has fallen by the wayside. The system is broken. Doesn't that sound very much like Anonymous is on the side of the people? What are we supposed to expect anonymous to do today May 19th 2013 they call it operation apocalypse now I don't know about you but that doesn't sound very kindly to you and me as American citizens what does it mean what are they going to do 51913 expect us they are referring to all US banks denial of service shutdown attack they're telling us that they are going to hack in to every bank in America while merging with Al Qaeda against America to create a denial of service shutdown of all banks in the United States including Bank of America, Chase Bank, Wells Fargo, Capital One, on and on and on. Every bank in America they are targeting. That doesn't sound very friendly like they are on the side of the people. They sent us a coded message. Here is the verbal message from Anonymous that was sent along with this coded message. Greetings Obama and USA citizens. We are the nameless crew, Nephilim's crew. Anonymous will make sure that this May 7th will be a day to remember. On that day, Anonymous will start Phase 1 of Operation USA. America, you have committed multiple war crimes in Iraq, Afghanistan, Pakistan, and recently you have committed war crimes in your own country. You have killed hundreds of innocent children and families with drones, guns, and now bombs. America, you have hit thousands of people where it hurts them. Now it is our time for our lulls. For this you shall pay. This attack is coming on American citizens, the people of America. You remember this is exactly how I told you martial law would go down. 
with a U.S. or World Bank catastrophe from hacking into the system, bringing the banks down, we would be told we'll have a 72-hour window where we will not be able to use the bank but after that it should be fixed and no problems but what really is going to happen within that 72 hour window of lulling the masses is martial law martial law will be put in place and when that 72 hours that we're told is going to be a buffer is over martial law will already be in place and money in America will be no more we're being told that attack began on May 7th and we're being told to expect anonymous today today is not completely over we're also being told not to be lulled if it doesn't come to completion today wait for the next few days the next few weeks they're going to get it done they're working with Al Qaeda and this is how it's going to go down it's very close and this follows right on the heels of the Pentagon going code red they have stated to the United States and to the world that the Pentagon unilaterally has granted itself authority over civil disturbances they're saying US military has power to initiate martial law with or without Obama's consent on May 13th just last week the White House Twitter page was hacked into the Twitter page showed the eagle on the seal of the United States upside down a fallen eagle our might brought down revelation 6 3 and 4 when the lamb opened the second seal I heard the second creature say come then another horse came out a fiery red one its rider was given power to take peace from the earth and make people kill each other to him was given a large sword these people say they want peace 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 where there is no peace these people work for the enemy our enemy they call themselves legion a host of demons it's time we come to know our enemy come out from them and do not align ourselves with them the deception Jesus said in Matthew 24 would be so great as to deceive even the elect if that were possible if some of you elect have aligned yourselves with this group of anonymous you need to know these people are of Satan and they are being used of Satan now I realize by saying that I am going to come under terrible attack by anonymous and those who are behind anonymous my weapons are not physical they are prayer they are God's Word they are knowledge part of that knowledge is coming to know our enemy and in the name of Jesus people you are being exposed now even now before the face of all those who will see this is Rev Michelle Hopkins thank you for watching and God bless you